Hello, my name is Adrian Hoynowski and I'm an orthopaedic surgeon. But I specialise in hand, wrist and elbow conditions. So common operations uh, would be a carpal tunnel decompression. Carpal tunnel, a problem of nerve entrapment that often wakes you at night with a numb, tingly hand. And that can be easily resolved uh, through a simple operation performed under local anaesthetic with generally good results. However, hand surgery also covers really quite complex conditions as well and that could include Dupuytren's disease, a fibrous contracture of the palm of the hand. It could include tendon or complex reconstructive problems. And for many patients, osteoarthritis, whether primary, meaning just developing with age, or secondary as a result of some previous trauma. The hands are one of the most sensitive structures of the body and can be extremely painful. Nerve entrapment, such as carpal tunnel syndrome, can be very troublesome. A simple surgical release operation can really dramatically improve or in many cases completely cure the problem. Fibrous contractures of the hands, such as Dupuytren's disease, are very disabling. The fingers catching and hooking round objects, the inability to straighten the hand, and surgery can certainly go a long way to improve that problem. Painful arthritis of the hand can be dealt with, uh, whether through a simple steroid injection or through even procedures such as joint replacement or fusion, and these can be very successful at significantly improving hand function. These complex conditions do take time and surgery may not always be uh, the best way of dealing with the condition. There are other treatments such as hand therapy, supportive treatments and they sometimes are better for these more complex procedures. Really it's taking the time to explore the patient's problems and to come up with a solution. A consultation with me at Spire Hospital Norwich involves a calm, relaxed atmosphere and time can be spent with the patient really understanding their problems and fixing them.